What's going on folks? In today's video I am type swapping Tyranitar from a rock dark type into a water dragon type. Um, I know this is kind of popular amongst the uh, content creators here on YouTube who do a lot of fake mons. They do these, this whole type swapping thing. Um, I was just chilling at work one day just randomly doodling in my notepad and I was just trying to think of like a Pokemon so I just randomly decided uh, on Tyranitar and then the first typing that popped in my head was water dragon so that's what I went with here. Um, I could kind of walk you through the uh, design aspects. So, dragon, obviously there's going to be dragon aspects incorporated into the design that you can clearly see. Um, for the water, there's aquatic type, so you have like sharks, so that you can see influences in the head and the tail fin. There's, you know, this classic kind of frills on the back. Something important to keep in mind, just whenever, if you want to design your own, you know, fake mon or creatures, characters, whatever it is, something important to have a good design is you want to have cohesiveness throughout it so if you look at what i'm doing here you can see throughout there's the shape of triangles throughout the entire uh the concept of it so you can see in the eyes that the shape of the head the gills the the claws the scales um the the tail fins everything there's triangles consistently throughout and that's what you want to have when you're doing your own designs that's what makes a good design and that's what i feel like a lot of these pokemon in these recent generations where they're lacking because i have not been a fan of most of the designs lately i i'm not a gen 1 -er by any means i think gen 3 was peak of pokemon designs but i just think lately their designs are just all over the place so that's why like you'll see pokemon and one of the things people commonly say is it doesn't look like a pokemon and I think it's just because there's not cohesiveness in the design. So that's just something important for you to keep in mind uh, whenever you're coming up with your own concepts. Um, but yeah, besides that, I still haven't quite nailed the, the Pokemon style. I just went with the um, the pencil tool here in Procreate for the line art and the colors. I, they kind of It has this kind of cell sh mix of a, like a cell shade watercolor type look, which I kind of tried going with here. I need to I need to study it a little bit more to figure it out. The color palette itself of the new design here, I wasn't sure what to go with. I, I just picked some random colors. It kind of looks like freaking Miami Dolphins colors, but whatever. You get the you get the gist of it. You can clearly see it's a dragon type and you can see it's a water type. So it turned out okay, I guess. Um, but yeah, that's it. There's the design. Let me know in the comments down below what you think. Do you have any suggestions for future Pokemon you'd like to see me do this with? If you like the video, go ahead and do me a solid. Hit that like button and subscribe to the channel if you're new here. I really appreciate it. Uh, but yeah, that's it for me. And until next time, I'll see y'all later. Peace out.